Scotland this morning. You can see from the air mass pictures there, we've got this northwesterly wind, which is brilliant, but colder air from the Arctic. It tends to turn away, we'll see this next band of showery rain spreading into the southeast tonight. We still have that rather brisk northerly wind, and that's going to bring some clouds and rain at the eastern area of the UK in the Tuesday. Good morning guys and welcome back to the Sullivan family. It is Monday morning. It is all systems go for back to school. I don't even know what time we got up this morning. I think it was five-ish, something like that. Quite an early start this morning since we've been getting up at like half past six, which for us is an absolute lie-in. Um, that's the teens gone. Everybody else is, we've been getting ready this morning as you've seen from the video. Um, breakfast in and getting everybody ready. Yes. Look what I made for Erin. Oh, it's, is it one of those, um, what's that, what is it? Hmm? I thought it was something else then. I thought, yeah, they're called a fortune teller. It's not a fortune teller, it's is it? It's not a fortune teller. One of those things that you go like that and it, and it goes, pick a colour, pick a number. You've been making those all holiday, haven't you? Yeah. yeah. So what is I've it? I've been practising for to make these, but then I finally made a good one. What is it? Whoa! Wee. It's a howler. It's a howler like of Harry Potter, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Harry Potter. I made it for Aaron. That's really cool, darling. That's really cool. Really cool. <laughs> <laughs> you and that tooth. <laughs> she likes showing off her tooth. She's going to show everybody at school this morning, she said. I'm going to show everybody at school my tooth. I'm going to show everybody at school. So, we've been getting everybody ready this morning. Um, lots of people have been moaning. Lots of people don't want to go to school. Eva was moaning, she didn't want to go to school. Um, it's just that Monday morning thing, isn't it? Toby, it's very difficult with Toby. Um, he's uh, very much like that this morning. I'm gonna take baby Flo with me this morning because we did think, if we don't take Florence with us, if she thinks everybody's gone out without her, she goes a bit, nuts she likes to be with all the doing what everybody else is doing so what i'm going to do is i'm going to take her with me this morning just to show her that the kids have gone to school and um she's very very switched on that came out a bit weird she's very very switched on hello right joseph hello. we've managed to do joseph's hair a little bit <laughs> yesterday look right so we've done that thing again so what i did this time you'll see in the little short hello darling you're going to come to school with daddy this morning yeah, so I did a little short yesterday and I put all of this into a into like a bobble, into a ponytail and that then let us shave the sides up and then we tried to do a bit of a trim on top. Um, I think it looks okay. It does look way cool. Yes, darling, you all right? Are you okay? You gonna come to school with daddy this morning? Yeah? Look at it. I think it looks cool. It is. Well, it's as good as we can do um, until you just until you want to go to the hairdressers. Yeah, do you want to go to the hairdressers at some point? Same ones that Toby and um, when I go to Toby school, and Noah go to. When I say hello to the kids, I will. When you say hello to the kids at school, okay, no problem. I will. All right. Have you have you had your hair done? Is it all nice and curly? <laughs> curly. Right, let's have a look then. I made one for myself. Oh, very good. Let's have a look at your curly hair then, um, Leah. I can't work out which one was it then. It looks really nice, doesn't it? That's the that's those curly things, look. 
And if you go onto our Facebook, you'll see the photos that we got yesterday. Some of the lovely photos of um, the oh. girls with their curly hair. Looks really, really nice, doesn't it? Looks I'm really, really nice. I'm that up there. <laughs> Good boy, Joseph. You know the score. Well done. Yeah, your hair looks really nice, doesn't it? Mm. Like that. So we're almost ready to go to school. Hello. It's about 10 past 8 now. Almost ready to go. We're going to be leaving in about 10 minutes. Get everyone's coats on. We're going to be leaving in about 10 minutes to get over to school. Um, but it's been a very... No, so not, not a bad morning. It's just been a normal morning. But it's it's that kind of end of holiday feeling, isn't it, really? Of going back to school. What are you doing? Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Joseph. Thanks for backing up there. You all right? Is Erin getting her hair done? Yeah, she's getting her hair done. Good. And then I think we're pretty much there, so we'll be getting shoes on in a minute and stuff. Mm -hmm. Right. I don't know what the plan is for the rest of the day, guys. I've got no idea. Um, it's just catching up with jobs, the jobs list. And mm -hmm. you're right. Mm -hmm. Zoe's there. Say hi, Zoe. Hi, Zoe. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> right, guys. We are going to get on because I'm going to get them ready to go to school. Oh, there she is. Get them ready to go to school. So I'll see you in a bit. Yeah. That's all I need Some say life is boring But I disagree I wake up and live my dream Someday soon I'm gonna make it Yeah All hard work's gonna be worth it Ooh Everyone who didn't believe it Jojo's buddy, won't you? Yeah. Yeah? Hopefully. Hopefully. Cause Eva because when I was in primary one, Eva was my buddy. Oh yeah, she was here, right? Oh I can't remember. I know that Toby, your buddy was is he called Jaden? I don't know. I can't remember. Toby, do you know? Who your friend's buddy was? No. We had our old buddies, but me and I went to share a place and we both had a My buddy used to have friends. 
friends either. She, she has friends. My parking space is free. My favorite parking space. Yay! My favorite one. My favorite one. Daddy? Yeah? That's right, you have pallets down here, didn't it? Do you remember? There we go. We're here. Daddy, Daddy. Yep. Do you know when you buckle the bike seatbelt up, you put it in the wrong space? <laughs> Did I? Yeah. Oh, sorry. Yeah, but it was done up though, wasn't it? Yeah, it was by accident. It was done up though. Right. We are at school, guys. For the first day back at school, we're all popped up. We're a little bit early. But that's not a bad thing. No. No. Oh, did it, was the baby out. was the baby sleeping? Yeah. No. She wasn't sleeping. No. She, was oh, she might fall asleep when we go back in a minute. It's okay. No. I'll go get her. I'll go get her. Right. Anyway, we're, I'm going to get these to school. I'm going to give the baby a cuddle and get these to school. I need to get. Morning guys, it's quarter to nine. Uh, ben has taken the little ones to school. Florence is gone, obviously. Um, I kind of needed her to go on the school run because I need her to know that they've gone back to school because otherwise she'll just think that they've gone out and left her and um, wonder where they are all day. So I need her to kind of see them go to school <clears throat> and then she'll understand you know head that it's back to school because she gets very upset when everybody goes she doesn't like it at all um so yeah it's quarter nine all the older ones are gone um all the little ones are gone apart from joseph's here he's already too quiet i don't like it i hate back to school i know a lot of people you know love it when they go back to school um, I hate it when they go back to school. I really do. It's too quiet. Don't like it. Um, it's too quiet. Too quiet. I suppose the only good thing is, <clears throat> is that when they go back to school, I get up earlier because obviously we have to be up earlier. And I've said recently about how I'm staying in bed till sort of six, half six in the morning, which I know for most people is... Um, it's like really early, but for us, that's quite late. We kind of lose that hour in the morning. So it's it's quarter to nine. I've already done, one load of washing is done and out. Another load of washing's in. Um, and I'm already cleaning in the lounge. So that's the one benefit, I suppose, of, of, of getting up early and going back to school. Um, come the other end of the day, like nine o'clock tonight, I'll be on the sofa sleeping, but I'm much more productive in the morning anyway. I haven't put any makeup or anything on yet or even looked at my hair um but yeah it's, it's actually quite sunny but ben says it's quite cold out there i wanted them to go back in their summer dresses really but it's too cold it's only about six degrees so fingers crossed the weather starts getting better so that they can wear the summer dresses for a little bit at least um yeah so granny and granddad are halfway home um, they should get back by this evening. It takes them about 14 hours altogether driving and stopping. So they stop overnight, like halfway down and then drive the rest of the next day. Um, so obviously we've had a really full on couple of weeks with everybody being home, granny and granddad being here. Um, and now it's too quiet and I don't like it. And it's always after the fact that you think, oh, I should have done this. Should... Why do we just ply ourselves with so much guilt all the time about what we should have done and shouldn't have done? And just is it just is it just me? It can't just be me. It must be everybody. I must. I don't know whether it's ugh, I do it too much. I know I do it too much. You know, obviously we haven't been able to do as much as we wanted to do because the weather's been pretty rubbish. Um, and yeah, we can only do what we can do. I just like having them here. I don't like it when they go back. And there was some few that didn't want to go back. 
hate pushing them back when they don't want to go. Anyway, I'm going to go and sort out a new home for the Switch because the TV has taken up so much space um, that I don't have anywhere to put it. So, and in doing that, it means I've got to start dusting because where I was going to put it is dusty. So one job leads on to another, to another, to another. Um, and I'm determined to get some stuff done over the next while well, they've gone back to school. Some cleaning and some bits and bobs that maybe I haven't had time to do lately. I'm sure I will give myself a hard time in the meantime about stuff because that's just what I do. Obviously the older twins, I've actually only got about a week back at school and then they're off again for study leave <coughs> for their exams. Um, so yeah. Although Charlotte sometimes goes into school for study leave because she prefers to study at school. Um, I don't know exactly what their plans are just yet. I really still have some, some people in the house. It's very quiet. It's weird. I'm going to go and get on. Yeah, should we go and see if it's still there? Yeah, you can come. We're going to see if the uh, Sullivan family rock is still in the same place as we put it. Yeah, and we're both going to see it. We are. If you haven't told, if you can't it's tell already, bad, we bad. are down in the little weeds. I'm for the baby. Because I'm going to make sure, for the baby here. obviously weather permitting, no, no. that I'm going to be bringing these two down for a, or oh, these yeah. take these two up for a little walk it, every day if I can. No, it's all right. We'll get her out when we um when we get to our spot that we normally go to. Yeah, do you know what I mean? Yeah. Look at it in here, Joseph. Yeah, let's go. Look at it in here. Let's go. Hey. hey. I could live in the woods. I could live. I could live in the woods. I wonder if it's because thousands of years ago, <laughs> most of the country was covered in woodland. And it's in our DNA or something like that, you know, to love woodland and yeah. all that stuff. Yeah. Could so be, couldn't it? Because obviously thousands and thousands of years ago, when we were all hunter-gatherers and that, before farming started, most of the country was covered in forest. Fact of the day. It is. It's just us today because everybody else is at school. Yeah, we're going to see it. Yep. All of us are. And the thing is, All three of us. Joseph didn't want to come out for a walk today, did you? But we convinced you. And you love it, don't you? Yeah. Don't you? I told you, didn't I? We'll go on the walk this morning and you'd absolutely love it. Look at it. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Look at this. Look at that view, Joseph. Let's go down. Go on then. You know where to go. That's quite a view this morning, to be fair. This is my little spot. It is your little spot, you're right. Family spot. It is the Sullivan, Sullivan family spot. Let's go. Come on, let's go down. I can remember where it's hidden. We will find it together, Jojo. You're right. Yeah, and it's still there. I can see it. Where? 
Look, I'll show you. I'll get the baby out in a sec. I'll just show you. Do you remember, do you remember where we put it last time? I'll show you, look. Up here. Can you see it? Oh, yeah. No, I'm not about it's it. It's still here. I can't believe well, we'll, we'll just leave it. Well, I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll leave it here. Yeah? And we'll see if anybody finds see it. it. Yeah. See if anybody finds it. Okay? Yeah. Okay, I've got a question for you. What? So what can you hear? Birds. And what else can you hear? Birds. Can you hear the wind? No. What do you mean no? I can hear the wind. I can't. I've just tried to get Flo out with the buggy. She didn't want to get out. She said she wanted this. Oh, thank you. Thank you very much. She said she wanted to stay in the buggy and have a blanket on. In two-year-old speak. Blanket on. I was like, okay. All right then. But Joseph's looking after her, bless her. I don't know why she doesn't want to get out of the buggy. She normally does. What have you found? A pine cone. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. I'm in love with my cool hair, Daddy. Yes, I like your cool hair. I don't know how we managed it. I had help from Charlotte. Charlotte helped to do yeah. your hair yesterday, didn't she? I it's don't know so how we managed cool. it. That is so cool. It is pretty cool. Isn't it? Are you right, Flo? Yeah, I don't know what's up with her this morning. She's, she just doesn't want to... Okay, we're out of the buggy. She's in a very stubborn mood. <sighs> I don't want to go in the buggy, I don't want to go out of the buggy, I don't want my blanket on, I don't want my blanket off. Yeah. She's in a very, very stubborn mood, aren't you? Eh? Mm. Mwah. Like all your sisters, stubborn. Yes. But I'm not stubborn. You're not stubborn. So, uh, I don't know if we've said this already, but we've given Granny and Grandad a couple of uh, pebbles to take back with them. I can't remember if I've said that already. But we have. They've got a couple of pebbles they're taking back to Cornwall to hide um, on beaches and woods. Uh oh, Joseph, Joseph, pick that up for me. There you go, good boy. Well done. Yeah, so they've got they've got a couple of pebbles to take down to Cornwall with them. Oi! 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 And what they're going to do is Granny's going to film a little bit for us. She's going to film a little bit for us. When they put the when they put the pebbles down, <laughs> I'm just gonna send it to me. <laughs> put my hat on, you monkey. <laughs> I love your stick, darling. It's a really nice stick. Mm, it's my heart. Mm. It's my heart. Mine. My heart. It suits you actually. It really does. Come on then, Joseph. Right, we've got Flo back in the buggy. She wants to go back in the buggy. She's not very happy today. I don't know what's the matter with her. She's not her normal self. Right, guys. We are going to go home now because it's nearly lunchtime. But we've had our lovely little half an hour in the woods, haven't we, Joseph? Yeah. It's been really, really special. I love it. But we're going to go back now, aren't we, and catch up with Mummy? Yeah. Yeah? I'm going to take a long in here. <laughs> right. We'll see you back at home, guys. Bye. Say hi, everybody. Say hi. Say hi. Say hi. You're not saying hi today? No? Say hello. Say welcome back to the Sullivan family. Say subscribe. Subscribe. <laughs> yes! Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Anyway, guys, uh, it's after lunch. Zoe's just nipped out to get Isabel because Isabel now, she's got like this week left at school. She's got study leaves. 
and then next week she's on permanent study leave for, for her exams. So she's going to pick Isabel up. I am going to go to the tip run. I'm going to go to the tip in a minute, in a minute to do the tip run. I've got about eight bags of rubbish to take to the tip, so I'm going to do that. And that will lead me then straight into picking the kids up from school. So, it's again, the day just disappears, doesn't it? You get a few things done. You go for a nice walk down the woods. And I don't know what the baby's doing. And then all of a sudden, careful my glasses, darling. All of a sudden, it's half past one. And, um, oh, look, they're back. They're back. Hi. Guess who's here? Isabel. Is Isabel here? <gasps> who's that? <laughs> <laughs> Look at her yeah. face. Go give Isabel Hello. a cuddle, and monkey. She loves Isabel to bits, absolutely to bits. Are you alright, Isabel? Yeah. Cool. So now that they're back, I'm going to get the car loaded up, and then it's my turn to go. To, it's my turn to go out then to the tip to get rid of the bags. You're alright. Is everybody okay? <laughs> Bless her. She misses her, Isabel so much. I've got my little friends back. How was your day? Good. Yeah? So have you learned anything good today? Yeah! Go on then, what have you learned? We learned yeah. about the ancient, the ancient... Egypt? Egypt. You were telling me outside, weren't you? Yeah. So what did you learn about Egypt? Um, that this is also in Africa, where it was. It's in Africa, yeah, that's right. Yeah. Was she? Yeah. Oh, awesome. And we learned like how um so um, they um they only had um a they didn't have any paint, so they had to make paint out of chemical Spice. spices and stuff. Yeah. Spices, spices, yeah. And they only had like um like black, grey and green. Alright, cool. Red. How about you, Agnes? Did you not? Not that much. Maybe it was because it was the first day back. Was it a good day though? Yeah. Good. And um, Mrs. Mitchell Tim and Mrs. Maxwell made um, these little book clips and we did like a three sheets of work and on the top, like on the like really orange bit on the top, we sticked one of our, we sticked our map on and then we had to put a little orange dot where um, where the place was that we were learning about. Yep. And then we had to do a line and write what we were, um, we had to write the country that we were learning about. Cool! And then stick it on the front and then put just put our work in the little pocket. Cool. How about you, Toby? Did you have a good day? Yeah. You did have a good day today, yeah? Mm -hmm. High five. Good boy. Glad you had a good day. Right, guys, I'm glad you had a good day. It's nice to see you again. I missed you today. I miss you because we've been going on walks and stuff, haven't we? Yeah. Yeah, but we did go. Me and um, me and Joseph and Florence went on a little walk, which was nice. Um, but we missed you guys because because it's more fun in it when there's more people. Yeah. Yeah. Right. We're we gonna go home and see mummy. Yeah. No way. You're not having sweeties on a Monday. No chance. You have a normal snack, yeah. Why do you not have sweeties on Monday? Because it's Monday. And Friday. Because you can't have sweeties every day. You can't have sweeties Monday. every day. No, it does not. <laughs> right, we're going home. Yeah, let's go home. Oh, so we're not doing a shopping vlog tonight. Did those words even just come out then? Because I just feel like I just literally spewed some words out. Um, we are not doing a shopping vlog tonight, mainly because I've kind of done half the shopping already. I did some last night because we ran out of so many things um so i'm kind of just 
we just thought we won't do one and because it was back to school today we thought we'd do a back to school vlog instead shopping vlogs oh it's police car shopping vlogs will be back next week um we're doing sausage casserole though if anybody is interested we're doing sausage casserole tomorrow night um i think we might be having jack of potatoes and pasta pasta tonight kids have had pasta tonight so yeah we're not doing a shopping vlog but i don't actually know where the day's gone kids all seem to have a nice day at school which is good um i only saw them kind of briefly but they did seem to have a nice day at school and granny and granddad have got back to cornwall it's elizabeth with more, more teasers um they got back to cornwall about four o'clock so they left scotland yesterday at about 10 a.m just before 10 a.m um they stayed overnight somewhere around manchester i think got there about seven o'clock last night set off again this morning um i think they said about half nine this morning entirely sure i might be wrong got back about might be a bit later got back about four o'clock this afternoon so it's a really long journey it's like probably 12 hours 30 12 13 hours drive but obviously there's time for stops and all that sort of stuff as well i think if we were to drive it it might take us like a week i just 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 i can imagine the older ones used to do quite a lot of road trips because we lived we moved from cornwall to north wales when we had elizabeth and olivia so we used to do that journey quite a lot um like quite a lot lot and i used to drive i used to i don't know why i can't drive long distances now because i used to drive them all the time that then um and then we moved to oxfordshire and we did used to do oxfordshire to cornwall quite a lot as well but um the last time we moved back up to oxfordshire from cornwall was when i was pregnant with eva and we've never been back to cornwall since then because after not long after that we moved to scotland um and that's where we've been ever since so the journey for us the little ones have never really been anywhere further than an hour <laughs> two hours maybe aberdeen is probably the furthest the older ones have obviously been further <clears throat> i mean the eldest ones they travel sort of up and down glad to go in that so they're used to longer journeys but the longest journey any of them have ever done is moving up to scotland and that was when toby was about five months old so all of the younger ones than that have never done a long journey so i don't know if we'd probably be better off flying if we went to cornwall from inverness maybe to bristol or something and hiring a van minibus or something from there i don't know really i mean road trip sounds fun until you get like 14 people in a van and then maybe it's not so much fun after the first three hours and obviously we'd have to stay overnight so weighing up costs we probably need about five hotel rooms i don't know uh part of me thinks it would be better to drive it i've got a fly bug and um part of me thinks that it wouldn't obviously it's quite expensive as well so anyway um yeah we're not doing a shopping vlog so i'm going to take this lot home and get them to put it away i say get them to put it away because i don't like putting it away so um the girls and ben put it away uh yeah then that's uh, the day is is pretty much done and the hours have just gone really quick but at least it's monday's done done and dusted <coughs> And it's raining again. Rubbish. Anyway, I'm going to take this lot home. Okay, guys, that's it for today. We are all done. We've got Isabel making a cake for Elizabeth's birthday. We've got Charlotte doing something behind us. That's what she's doing. Hi. Doing her lunch or something. I'm making her lunch for tomorrow. I'm just eating the cake mix. Toby seems to be in quite good spirits for now, which is a bonus, which I'm really happy about. So we'll see how it goes. It's, it's only day one, isn't it? So we'll see how it goes, mm. day one back to school. Uh, there was something else I was going to say. 
What else was I going to say? Was it low? I can't remember now. It's getting a bit late now, guys. It's getting a bit late. Um, but it's been quite a successful day. Got kids to school. Kids seem quite happy. Um, nothing else to report, really. Oh, shopping's been put away. Shopping's done. Shopping's done, put away. Um, and tomorrow is another day. There's more vlogs to come. Anyway, guys, that's it for now. Please subscribe to our channel. Please hit the bell for notifications. Just drop us a like. Don't forget our link tree in the video description below for all of our social media, our Facebook, Instagram, uh, the charity homepage, and Leopard Fox Designs. And that just leaves us to say uh, thank you so much for your support, guys. Take care, and we'll see you in the next video.